welcome or welcome back to creation of her this is going to be kind of new for me because for the sake of my lack of editing skills i am not going to be editing this out at all because i want the screen recording to match up with my voice so this is going to be very raw but anyways i have come out with a notion planner and i want to do a walkthrough for you guys because a lot of you guys have bought it a lot of you guys love it and i'm very happy about that um but there's it's kind of like a your whole life is in here and I feel like a walkthrough would just be so fun and very informative, very helpful. And also for those of you who haven't bought it and who are interested in seeing what's inside, interesting, interested in seeing if you want to buy it, you can see what's inside of it. So let's get into it. So this is the homepage. Um, it has Becoming Her, cute little pictures. You can change this aesthetic if you want. Here you can change the cover. You can change whatever you like. Once you download it, it's all yours. So it's your own copy. Um, this is just my vibe, so do what you want with it but i just have um for example like here in the drop down it'll tell you how to download it to make it yours which then once you follow these steps get your own copy and stuff you can just go to these like three dots here and delete it if you want or keep it doesn't really matter but that just gives you more information so when you go here the first section you have the planners this is probably what i use the most out of like my copy of the planner um so in the daily planner you have habit tracker i always talk about accountability um and then of course you can just customize this as you want play around with it if you are familiar with notion this will be very easy for you if you're not it might take a bit to get accustomed to it but just play around with it you can put all your habits here and then check them off throughout the week and then uncheck them all when you're done to reset um i think there's also an option to reset but um I don't know i'm not that like tech savvy so this is my best work um anyways i always also talk about having okay always having the top three priorities for the day i do not believe in anymore having super long to-do lists that don't make any sense okay it's okay to have a long to-do list as long as you're splitting it up into like fluff and actual priorities because if something happens something gets life gets in the way as it does or just for your mental health it's important to know your top three, right? So you have your top three priorities. You can put your secondary tasks as well. And I personally time block. I think it's the most effective way to go about your days and about your life just because you're not over planning and also you can maximize your time. Things are more organized. So we have time blocks here. There's also an energy check-in um, just to be in tune with yourself. You can use it. You cannot use it. You could delete it for all I care. You can do an affirmation too. This is if you're just really getting into the vibes of it there's also morning afternoon and evening if you want to split up your to-dos for the day that way and then we have the weekly planner um and here when like for example today is tuesday but i'm thinking okay thursday i have this event or my friend planned to go on the rooftop with me on thursday so i'm gonna go to the weekly planner and i'm gonna write it on thursday and every night i go back and i replan and i plan my next day so i will go into the weekly thing or the monthly if needed and i will like you know see what needs to be planned for tomorrow um and then we have of course the monthly planner because then things pop up throughout the month you know flights projects events etc we have future projects to plan in um just so you don't forget you know everything's there there's monthly goals as well again i feel like three is just always a good way to go about things you don't really want to overload yourself so three monthly goals is super fun super fine <laughs> um notes and reflection this is so weird for me to do like a non a no cut video usually i mess up a lot anyways we also have a quarterly planner um i got into quarterly planning when i got an accountant and especially if you have a business this will make a lot more sense for you but it's just like you're planning out like for three months just every quarter of the year so you can go through that you know we have like the breakdown progress check and it's like all the quarters of the year so this is pretty self-explanatory i don't want to spend too much time on that but that's the planner section then we have here is the her section again these pictures you can change them out if you want to like if you want to make it your own aesthetic so we have here the her money and career glow up so here you can track your accounts and you can track what's in them you can either do this like as your income as well you can create a budget here um you can track your income here as well 
and here are your expenses like usually your bank account will show you and if you want it like just to have it all in one place and so you're aware of your finances which it's better to be aware than just like turn a blind eye i feel like we've all done that at one point but you know part of being her is getting those finances in order and not being afraid of money building a healthy relationship with money so here we can have like things that can evoke thought in you um limiting beliefs you know prompts to just foster your relationship with money honestly and then we have your career progress tracker these are all prompts that you can they're very self-explanatory skill learning obviously these are totally optional totally to help you and totally deletable if you don't want them there it's just if you want you don't need to do it all at once you can do one little prompt a day it's honestly just for fun and to help you reflect on your life so that you can become the woman that you were always meant to be so this again is just success and growth tracker these are like all prompts to help you and if you're not buying it by all means screenshot write them down at the end of the day my goal is to help you not really sell you um this is just if you want the easy route we're gonna have to pay for it (laughs) obviously because this took time and resources so this is um identity and vision board which i love like this is really deep diving into you it's yes you have like your daily and your weekly and monthly planners and stuff and you can only use that section if if that's what you want but on the days where you're like "Mm, let me get into it like you have all of this stuff here to help you and you can do it one page at a time you know one day you work on one page the next day another page however you want next here we have my menus which i love so this is like a dopamine menu i feel like our dopamines are so 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 messed up these days um like we're just always scrolling or we're always reaching for the vape or the cig or the snack or the something so this is just a way to give you ideas to reset your dopamine and these are like examples that i have here but you can obviously delete these and like make your own dopamine menu based on what makes you happy um so that way like you don't have excuses when you're reaching for the vape you know you know calling you out we have the evening menu. I think something I struggled with a lot was creating a nighttime routine that made me happy. So I would just emotionally eat at night a lot because I had nothing to look forward to at night. Now I do. I know. So I think it's actually more important than we think. So we have evening and morning menu too so that you can just have options based off what you want to choose for the morning, the evening. I want your life to be fun and you should want your life to be fun next we have success and growth so we have these are more like check-ins and journaling um so we have like your nightly check-in here and you can go through that this just helps you reflect on the day what worked what didn't work so that tomorrow can be a better day as well as the weekly check-in again it's important to reflect what worked this week what didn't work what do i want for next week again i'm giving you guys everything if you don't want to pay for it you can screenshot it but if you want it all in one place you can go and get it um and then this is monthly check-in which is also so important i definitely believe in having a meeting with yourself every single month um so that you're not bringing in old crap from the month before and so that the following month can be so much better like just one hour of reflection like a self-meeting can do wonders for your life so if you like don't even know where to start when i say have a monthly meeting with yourself all you need to do is set the date click on this tab and that's your monthly meeting i know i know i made it so easy for you and then we have journaling hub if you are someone who i travel a lot so i like to have somewhere to journal on the go i also when i'm home i like to journal on paper but on the go i bring my ipad or my computer everywhere so i have my journals here there's a shadow work journal again you don't have to do this all in one day, the day that you buy it. This is just when you want, when you feel like it, when you feel like you're ready to, you know, tickle your brain a bit with the journaling. We also have morning journals. So in the morning, some of you can come here every single morning and journal it out and start your day with that. There's also AI mindset framing, which I use AI for a, like a lot of the shifts that I've made in my life. Like AI knows so much information about me that I'm like, what are my downfalls? And it has it like to the point. So um, yeah, like there are different prompts that I put here for you guys. If you want to experiment with AI journaling, AI just life shifting. I think that a lot of people, especially my videos, have left me some comments like, I was like so into your video until you mentioned AI. 
babe like if you're using it for you for your improvement and for good things by all means i mean again if you don't want to use ai look three dots just delete the page um and then here we have the gratitude journal i gratitude journal every single morning so when i'm on the go and i have this it's perfect um so yeah we have your little journals there again this is just like i wanted to give you guys a lot this you don't have to use all of it it's just there if you want it and if you want to delete it that's also available here's a mood board i love it this is very much my vibe my aesthetic i feel like it's also so summer right now or just honestly any season but again you can change these out whatever you want i just i think it's cute it's part of the aesthetic and here we have the last sections which is just the goal setting method um and here we have the 90 day her goal roadmap so the one three goal setting method this is just teaching you how to set goals so that we can set goals using this planner and so that you can use it to the best of your ability to become the woman you're always meant to be not the one you aspire to be because you just need to peel back the layers of the onion she's already deep there inside of you you know what i'm saying so that's there you can go through that it's very simple just teaching you how to set goals effectively and the reason i actually started this template i had done a 90 day her becoming her series and so this notion template was kind of not in conjunction with it but created out of it if that makes sense but this template can be used forever at all times but if you are not going back to that series and you want it here in the template uh there's everything here for you so there's phase one which is month one and this is the things we learn in phase one and then we go into phase two phase three and all of that so if you're really if you really want a deep dive into that um this will also give you you know an introduction if you want to coach with me later on which is coming up and just all of the other videos templates products courses and everything i'm going to come out with this will really give you a good introduction to all of that and well it can't hurt you know it's only helpful but again obviously not mandatory here if you want to write out your morning and your evening routine i tend to do that just because i don't want to remember okay i'm gonna do x y and z tomorrow morning no i just like to know i don't know i like to write somewhere where my morning and my evening sorry what my morning and my evening routine is in case i want it to be a specific way and i forget so you can just write that there again if not just leave it there there's also like a playlist here which you can also change you can delete for all i care it's it's all you okay this is yours now if you get it so that is basically the rundown i don't know if that was too fast um let me know i mean 12 minutes i didn't even know i was filming for that long okay anyways that's the whole rundown um you obviously cannot share this template if you buy it legally you cannot like send the link or something for someone else to copy uh this is yours you bought it whatever and whoever else wants it can get it on their own but if you're watching this video and you want to steal the prompts for yourself or something not to sell it but just for your own use and you don't want the template you just want like the information that i showed i don't really care and <laughs> i can't stop you so i hope it helps you regardless but if you want it all in one place again the template is here for you organized pretty and ready to go um so you can find that in the description you can find it in my stand store which is in the link of all of my bios in all of my socials at the mia gabriella everywhere so definitely go and check that out if you're interested and yeah that's the walkthrough